Well, as I said, I know you have participated in Ask the Pastor. Of course, you've been on uh, TCT Today, many other programs. But uh, just wanted to ask you to share uh, kind of one of your memories of being involved in, with TCT over the years. Well, we're... We were excited to be here when, you know, we got a call several years ago. Uh, we had just got to Kentucky. Uh, we were working on the foundation of the ministry, and I knew then that once I got involved, I was going to stay involved. So I held off for about a year, year and a half, and by the second year we started, and uh, Miss Sheila had got us to come up, and uh, we, once we got started, we just plugged in, and it's really blessed us. It's given us a, a, a platform to just show people what God is doing and let them know that God reigns even in Kentucky. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. But do people have doubts? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, when you look at it, most of the pastors are coming from Illinois, and they're coming okay. from Missouri, and so I wanted Western Kentucky to be represented. So <laughs> we're, we're bringing you a, a little portion of God from the beautiful Ballard County. Oh, well, you do a great job of that. And from this station, yeah, we reach not just uh, Southern Illinois here, but uh, Kentucky and, uh, and Missouri. And Ryan, you come from a, a church over in Missouri representing uh, that area here on Ask the Pastor. I do. I come from Festus, Missouri, which is just south of St. Louis. And I've been so blessed over the last several years to be a part of Ask the Pastor TCT today and also been here for partnership. And I want to say the greatest blessing, there are many things I could say about being connected to this great network, but the greatest blessing is really a testimony that God has just done in the last couple of months. It was about a year and a half ago that I came to partnership and uh, we were in a major debt reduction campaign. We were believing God to be debt free and, and to pay our church building off. And I was praying about what we should give for partnership. And I talked to our board and, and some of our key leaders and I said, God has really placed on my heart for us to sow a significant seed into TCT, believing for debt freedom. And at that time, we owed $168,900 is all we had left to pay off on our building. And God spoke to us to give a gift of $1,689 and to believe for a 100-fold return for that gift. And so I came and at the end of the night, I came to Dr. Garth and to Miss Tina and I said, I, I want you guys to lay hands on this seed and pray over this. And I said, we're really believing God to be totally debt free and to bless us with a miracle harvest on this seed. And we just gathered around one of the tables back in the green room and they laid hands on it and anointed it. And I'm so excited. We have outgrown our facility where we were currently at and we put it on the market and we thought, man, you know, it, it might take a little bit to sell. Property doesn't always move fast in the community we live in. We had a contract on it in two days, paid the building completely off, had money in the bank, and God's blessed us with a totally new location, bigger, better. And I believe with all of my heart what the Word of God says, that the generous soul, the, the Lord said in Proverbs, the generous soul will prosper, and whoever waters others will themselves be watered. And by partnering with TCT, by investing and this soul-saving ministry that's going around the world, God brought a miracle harvest in our lives. And so I'm so thankful to be connected here and for what God's done. It's awesome. To find out more about the TCT Network, visit us at tct.tv.